With new information constantly coming in, we know everyone has a lot of questions concerning coronavirus and how it changes the way we need to do things. Dr. Frank McGeorge is back to answer more of your questions involving everyday activities, Doc. Let's start with a personal protective equipment question. A viewer asks, I often see people with gloves and no mask or a mask and no gloves. Which is better? Well, that's fairly straightforward. A mask is definitely a more important choice than gloves. You can wash your hands, but a mask is the best way to filter the air you breathe in and out. With the weather warming up, several viewers have asked recently, is it safe to swim in a pool once they open for the season? The answer is yes. There is no evidence that the virus can spread by water, especially if it's chlorinated. The bigger issue is going to be maintaining an appropriate distance since you won't be wearing a mask while you're swimming. Another commonly asked question, given the COVID-19 outbreaks in meat processing plants, is whether pork, chicken, or beef are still safe to eat. Well, the answer is yes, since you're going to be cooking the meat. The outer packaging, though, should still be treated like any groceries and hopefully you're taking the usual precautions when handling raw meat. Now here's another interesting question. Is it possible for us to use too much hand sanitizer? Could the virus become resistant? Well, the answer is no. Chemical disinfectants like alcohol and other cleaning agents work by directly destroying the virus. There is no opportunity for a virus to become resistant to cleaners. Now, finally, another viewer asks, can COVID-19 live on fresh cut flowers or plants being sold at my grocery store? Well, the virus wouldn't likely live very long on plants or flowers themselves, but you should treat the flower pot or the plastic wrap as you would any item at the grocery store. Wipe it down with a disinfectant wipe and wash your hands after you're done. Back to you.